1958, deep inside a Los Alamos laboratory, chemical technician Sitzel Kelly was cleaning a plutonium tank when something went wrong. The liquid inside had become supercritical, a self-sustaining nuclear reaction. There was no explosion, no flash visible to the outside world. But in an instant, Kelly's body absorbed a lethal dose of radiation, enough to destroy his cells from the inside out. When co-workers found him moments later, his skin was burning from within. His pupils had shrunk to pinpoints. He said, I feel like I'm burning up, before collapsing. Doctors tried experimental treatments for 35 hours, but his body literally liquefied his organs from the radiation. The government classified the details for years. One man, vaporized by invisible fire, in a lab that was supposed to make the world safer, and his death was only one of several the public was never supposed to know about.